a.m. at a Twilight Zone convention in the San Fernando Valley of Los Angeles. Years before I did Star Trek, I did an episode of Twilight Zone titled The Encounter with Neville Brad. I had a wonderful experience working with Neville, someone who I watched on Playhouse 90 long before I became an actor, and so it was a real privilege to work on that episode with him. And I got a chance to meet Twi uh, Twilight Zone's creator, Rod Serling, which many of the actors on uh, Twilight Zone did not get a chance to do. So um, I have fond memories of Twilight Zone. The Twilight Zone was a television series created and often written by its narrator and host, Rod Serling. The episode that I worked on, The Encounter, was one of the last of the series. And the popularity of Twilight Zone still continues today, as you can see by the large number of people gathered here at this Twilight Zone convention. <laughs> the Encounter was a two-character drama. It's about a GI, a veteran of World War II, and a young uh, Japanese-American uh, gardener who um, come together on a lazy Saturday afternoon. The episode became controversial because the young Japanese-American gardener talks about his father, also a Japanese-American, having um, committed a traitorous act, uh, that of, guard, uh, of uh, guiding Japanese bombers into Pearl Harbor. This, factually, of course, is, did not happen. It is something that was, is uh, from the Twilight Zone. But because it was not factual, civil uh, liberties organizations and uh, history buffs uh, protested that. And, and there was this controversy concerning that particular aspect of uh, this episode. And it's been pulled from syndication. And so the, uh, the unique history of this particular episode that I worked on, The Encounter, is that it was never rerun again.